Welcome to the next video of our complete engine rebuild guide. In this one we are removing the primary drive and not lose any needle bearings along the way. In today's video we will take a look at what tools we need to complete this job, a step-by-step -step guide on how to complete it, and in the end we will do a hardware roundup to make sure that we do not lose any of our precious hardware. To make following the content easier you can pause this video at any moment. That said, let's take a look at what tools we need. For this job you need a ratchet driver, a 17mm socket, an old Phillips screwdriver or alternatively a punch, a mallet or hammer, and a small plastic bag. This will help for us capture the needle bearings. With our tools ready, let's take a look at the step-by-step -step guide on how to get this job done. One of the two things that usually falls out when you split engine cases is the kickstarter gear spring and the kickstarter gear itself which sits on the primary. As this video focuses on the primary, let's make sure we keep all these parts together even though I'm sure you remove them at an earlier point during your engine teardown. Before we loosen up the primary, take the plastic bag and put it over the so-called Christmas tree. This will help us later catch any needle bearings that are falling out. Bend back to tap on the lock washer for the primary nut. Loosen the nut and remove it. Remove both the washer and the lock washer that are situated underneath. The next goal is to tap out the input shaft. It is sitting in a bearing inside the primary so it takes a little bit of tapping until it pops right out. When you have it almost out, do the rest by hand. That way you'll be able to capture all the needle bearings that are sitting between the primary and the input shaft. Remove the primary and wiggle a little bit to get all the needle bearings off into the bag and make sure you have 21 of them. Anything transmission is now removed from the engine. Before we put away the hardware, let's make sure we have everything. We are left with the kickstarter gear spring and the kickstarter gear, nut washer and lock washer from the input shaft, the primary gear assembly, and 21 needle bearings. Thank you for watching, click here to get to the next video in this series. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, and if you like this, you can support us on Patreon, the link is in the description down below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.